y'all. So today is Wednesday. I'm in Houston. Starting um, route to the Breakfast Club. I'm in Houston. Um, this is not gonna work. But I'm in Houston. I had to come out here. Um, so I'm going to get me some breakfast and I wanted to go to break well really I was I really want some crawfish but it's too early um it's like almost 10 30 10 20 ish or whatever so <clears throat> let's see which way is this telling me to go okay so yeah I wanted to go I was thinking about going to Whataburger I need some kind of way to hold this up here my little thing but I didn't. so yeah mile, turn right onto Alabama Street oh this is Main Street too but yeah I was gonna go to Whataburger because like you know something fast and easy but then I was like oh shit I'm tripping I could go to the breakfast club and it's this place out here um they have like a lot of different kind of food dishes I guess not really different but just not the ordinary like breakfast sandwich and stuff they have like chicken and waffles and like you could get like shrimp and grits and that kind of stuff more like southern style um but they have regular stuff too but i've never went to the actual building like the restaurant i've only had it in the airport because they have one in the airport and when we went to Denver, that's when I first tried it. But I had always heard about it. And their chicken is so good. Like, <clears throat> the waffle is good too, of course. But the chicken is so good. It's like they soak it in hot sauce or something. Because the, whenever it's fried, like, you can, it tastes like hot sauce is on it. But it isn't any um, sauce on it at all. It's just, like, regular. So, yeah, I already went by there. And I didn't realize that it was gonna be so packed, but I know it's a popular place, but I was like, okay, like trying to see where can I park it? And it was a line, like people waiting outside. So I was like, fuck it, maybe I should just call my order in. So I kept going, like I passed up the building. I called my food in and then I just went and stopped at the store and got me some juice to go with my food. Yeah, I'm so ready, like I be ready to eat, like come on with it. So I'm by myself which sucks because I don't really like going places by myself but hey a bitch gotta grow up a bitch wait left yeah a bitch gotta grow up and get her life together because sometimes I'm gonna have to go places by myself so I'm not eating in there though I'm just gonna get it <clears throat> to go and then just go pull somewhere and eat or whatever in a quarter mile Turn left onto Alabama Street. I kind of lost where I was at though because I went kind of far, far down and it's not like I really just know this area or whatever like that. So I'm using my navigation. Um, and then later on today, I'm probably gonna go to this hookah spot because I have to be out here for a little while, but um, I don't really have a lot to do like that. So I just try to find something to do to pass the time until it's time for me to leave i don't want to tell y'all everything y'all probably like well what you there for like whatever like no i'm not telling y'all that so yeah i need something to pass turn left onto alabama street then turn oh, left I know onto I mean. travis street um i need something to pass the time because it's you know i have to be here turn God, left damn, onto travis this street. is ridiculous the like is honey right do i have to wait in line to pick up my food to go to like What's T, sis? And it don't look like they got no parking. Like, this might have been a badass idea. I'm about to call the number back and ask them. Because that don't make sense to me. Like, <clears throat> I would think that the people that's waiting in line or waiting to go in and order or waiting for a table but if I already called my food in I don't think that I should have to wait in line because the line is wrapped around the building y'all for real I'm about to call them back and ask them because they don't make no sense and they parking is not really good either so 
That's why I kind of just passed it up earlier because it's like, honey, what's what's tea? Good morning, and thank you for calling the Breakfast Club, the coffee shop that people dressed up like ready to go to the breakfast. breakfast club is located. Now these people is not playing over here. They looking to kill him for real. Like the line is around the building. I just called over and over because I guess they probably had other callers calling in. So they weren't picking up the phone. So I'm like, finally got somebody on the phone. I'm like, do I have to wait in the line to get a to-go order? And she was like, did you already call it? Like, you can call it in right now over the phone. And I'm like, no, I already called it in. But I'm asking, do I have to wait in the line outside to come get the to-go order? And she was like, no, you don't have to wait in the line, whatever. Like, honey, I don't see why anybody would be sitting there waiting. I mean, like that's too long honey like it's good but fuck all that i ain't trying to wait in line like that even if i did want to sit down and eat it here like mm -mm, i can't that line ridiculous so i'm about to go get my food i'm really not with the shits because i gotta go by myself but we gonna do what it do make it pop off or whatever and it's supposed to rain today. Well, it rained a little bit on my way here, so we're going to see. I'm going to be back. So, I ate my food. I didn't eat it all because I didn't want to get so full that I get, like, tired. And I feel like I didn't really get as much rest as I wanted to. Like, I could have definitely slept longer today, but I had to get up. So, a bitch didn't get as much sleep as I too, because I know I went to bed pretty late. It had to be after one or something, and I was up at like seven. So, yeah. Um, now, I'm probably gonna go. I wish this would stay. Oh, there we go. So, yeah, now I have to go. Wait, this is not working. So yeah, now I'm probably going to go to Cafe Layel. That's like a hookah spot out here. I'll probably go there and chill for a while. And then my best friend went to go do someone's hair. And she said she would come and meet me if she gets done in time. But she's still on her way there. So it's probably going to take forever. She said she's just doing a quick weave though. So maybe she might be able to come and meet me there. Or maybe I might go to a store. I was kind of thinking about going to like Ulta or something to makeup shop but i really don't need no makeup but i did kind of want to try like the makeup revolution concealers um and like their foundation and like some cheaper concealers and foundations and stuff like that to feature in videos but i just love the stuff that i use but sometimes i still want to find new stuff that i like um and i haven't really went to ulta and bought anything in a while so i don't know i might do that um but i'm not sure because i don't really feel like shopping much but yeah so i'm probably just gonna go smoke plus i didn't even get to smoke this morning at all so i might just do that Okay, y'all, so I made it to Cafe Lael, and I'm about to go in here. I'm not going to bring my camera because I'm by myself, and it's just weird. Um, but my best friend is supposed to come if she gets done in time, so maybe she will. I need to go use the restroom, so I'm going to get back with y'all later.